What's up, y'all? It's your boy JR Swag Life TV. I'm coming to you from Wifey Page, Lady Swag TV. And we're just prepping the meal for the night, man. Baby, go ahead and tell them what we're doing. Jamaican oxtails, Jamaican cabbage, and Caribbean cornbread. That's Jamaican oxtails, B. Jamaican cabbage, and Caribbean cornbread. And I mean, like I told you, we're going to give you that island feel with that exclusivity. But like I said, we're going to always bring you something exclusive, first rate, top notch, triple A. You dig? So, I mean, that's the meal for the night, man. Jamaican style oxtails. And right now, guys, I'm just searing them before I put them in the slow cooker. You heard that? We searing them before we put them in the slow cooker. We're going to give y'all the whole little shebang, man, the whole recipe. You're going to be able to see how everything done and everything. Let me hit this light for y'all so y'all can see. Look at that. Look at that beauty right there. I'm talking about there's a thing of beauty. To my good meat. Expensive meat. But y'all already know, like I said, why you stay lacing the plate. You know what I'm saying? Y'all get the first live, loud, and in color cooking show. Lady Swag TV. Recipe will be in the description box. So, man, I hope y'all tune in. Hope y'all enjoy this video. And, like I said, man, we're going to always bring it to you exclusive, direct, straight from the source. Mukbang coming soon. Mukbang will be coming up tonight. So y'all make sure y'all tune in Swag Life TV. We're doing the recipe on Lady Swag TV. Like I said, recipe will be in the description box. So make sure you check the description box for the recipe. Look at that, man. I mean, there's beauty right there, man. Yo, if y'all could be here right now and just smell the aroma. You know how I said about the slap your mama sauce? This that slap your mama aroma right here, B. You know what I mean? It, it'll just make you want to go up and be like, Mom, come here. Just a love tap, though, because that's your mom. You know what I mean? You don't want to hit her too hard. <laughs> <laughs> You gotta clean up as you go. You know what I mean? I always do, guys. I always do. You gotta make sure you clean up as you go. You know, don't want no unnecessary dishes when you get finished. That's if you wash it by hand. But, you know, we wash by hand and use the dishwasher on this side. So, you know. I'm talking about guys. If y'all can smell the aroma right now. Oh my goodness, I'm talking about it makes you just want to, hey, it makes you just want to just put the whole face in the in, in the skillet right now, man. I'm talking about the aroma that's permeating from these oxtails. Like I said, y'all know wifey, you know what I'm saying, certified in the kitchen, hands been blessed by the cooking guard. My mother. A.K.A. <laughs> my mother-in-law. It ain't nothing. Wifey don't know how to throw down in the kitchen and cook. You know what I mean? So like I said, more videos coming soon. More recipes coming soon. Recipes will always be in the description box of Wifey's videos. Or whatever it is that she's cooking. So, like I said, make sure you check the description box. Make sure... That you always tune in. You know what I mean? Because like I said, we appreciate the love. Appreciate the support. Always in the comments. We're going to always respond back. I don't care if we got 90 comments. We're going to respond to every one of them. Because like I said, without y'all, without the subscribers, without the viewers, you know what I'm saying? None of this would be possible. We want to be able to bring y'all these good recipes, these good cooking shows, these good mukbangs. 
You gotta make sure you sear them evenly. And I mean, you don't want you don't want them to be too overcooked or too undercooked on either side. So you gotta make sure you constantly flip them. Let them know how long you gotta let them sear, baby, before you put them in the in the slow cooker. If they really thick like these, at least ten minutes. I heard that ten minutes. That's ten minutes of constant flipping, making sure that every side is browned evenly. And like I said, they don't you, need to cook; they just need to brown. You know what I mean? You don't want to have them too brown on one side, too undercooked or overcooked on the other side. You want them to be cooked evenly. So when you put them in the slow cooker, you got that fall off the bone madness going on. Cause I'm telling y'all, yo, hey, if y'all could smell this right now, I mean, yo, I, I don't know what to tell you. All I know is, is the smell that's coming off these oxtails, man. Yo, some serious. Let me show y'all where we season the wick. all the jerk seasoning and the Jamaican seasoning that we had before we started sharing them when we was seasoning them up. But this is also what we use. You got the Lowry's. Of course, like I said, you got to slap your mama. You know what I mean? I don't know if wifey used this, but the Old Bay Lemon and Herb. I did. Alright. You got the black pepper. It don't matter what. I mean, if you can cook, honestly, if you can cook, it really don't matter black what pepper, brand of pepper. what brand of seasoning you use. You know what I mean? That's with any of it. You know what I'm saying? We got the Zatarans, cayenne pepper. Like I said, got the Old Bay. Got the Walk In Sun, slap your mama seasoning right here. And we got the Lowry seasoning salt. You know what I mean? All of the measurements and everything for the amount of sauce and the amount of seasoning that you use to season the meat. It's also, like I said, going to be down in this description box. But like I said, if you know how to get out, it really don't matter what brand of seasoning you use. Because either way it goes, it's going to turn out right anyway. Right now, what wifey doing, she's cutting up some green onions. She's going to slow cooker. You know what I mean? You got to have that thing. Ooh. Hey, yo. Like I said, man. This is the best you can do. I'm be super long, right? Yep. <laughs> Y'all don't care about the video being long. You know what I mean? Hey. You name me a cooking show. Because even when you watch Rachel Ray and Martha and Snoop and all that, they already had them, them finished products finished. They just showing you what they doing to, to, to make them. You know what I mean? But look at that, yo. This is also a T-Fail skillet. You know what I mean? Got the peppers over there. Got the orange peppers. Yellow peppers. And it's also at your discretion what you use to put in, you know what I'm saying, the slow cooker after you sieve your meat. It's at your discretion. You don't necessarily have to do it like wifey doing, but, you know, like I said, if you know how to burn, if you know how to get down in the kitchen, it's going to come out right anyway. Yo, y'all, real talk, my mouth over her water. All right, wife, you just turn the heat off. You know what I'm saying? And the heat that's still in the eye, we're going to let them get finished browning them. You know what I'm saying? I'm 
talking about. Do y'all hear that sizzle? Do y'all hear how it's getting down, man? Yo. Hey, hey. I'll make sure that I say y'all something. Or I share this meal with y'all tonight. Because this is a meal that I feel as though that y'all honestly should not be. You feel me? Y'all should not be deprived of this meal here. Because when I say the smell, just the smell itself. I should put them in the slow cooker. Like I said, y'all, y'all just want to sear them. Y'all just want to brown them. Evenly brown them. You don't want to cook them. You don't want to have them in the skillet with the heat too high. You know what I mean? You want everything to come out nice and brown. Evenly. Don't have to use your butter, but I do. See your wifey doing the butter that she used to simmer. She pouring them in the slow cooker. Yo, when I say that this meal is finna be banger, y'all don't know. 14 years I've been eating like this, yo. 14. You can add a little water or not. I just usually do. Because I will um, add my flour Add my gravy to it later as it cooks slowly down. So the water will be good use. Cover. Turn on high and let it cook. And you're done. There you go. That's right. That's oxtails made easy. You know what I mean? Lady Swag TV style. So, like I said, later on, man, the mukbang gonna be coming. The video coming soon. Y'all stay tuned. All right, one.